love you. I love you too. Is, is this real? You, you and Steffi are over? I couldn't let another day go by. I had to end it. I want to spend the rest of my life with you starting right now. Someone looks especially happy. Someone is ecstatic today. <laughs> It's really happening, Mom. Oh, honey. Liam and I are back together. I'm so delighted for you. It's been a long haul. It has, mm -hmm. and it has been worth every second to get to this point. I can't imagine Ridge is too thrilled. Uh, his first concern is Steffi. Hope called Brooke last night. Of course she did. Probably couldn't wait. How are you? I'm good. How are you really? We were happy, you know. There was nothing fake about my marriage. I'm so sorry that things didn't work out between you and Liam. I honestly thought they would. He disappoints me. No, Dad, you know what? Please, just... Don't be hard on Liam. The situation's much more complicated than it looks. And there must be something you're not telling me. Now would be a good time. That was fast. Yeah, I had to pull in a couple of favors to expedite. I told you I'd get it done. So all I need you to do is sign, and I will be headed over to Forrester. That's, that's good. Yeah. That's, that's good. I mean, you know, the, you're going and not some anonymous process server that doesn't care that Steffi's in pain. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, so this is it. So I just, I, I mean, I sign here, and then my marriage never happened. Well, that's the idea, unless you're getting second thoughts. No. No, hoping I have lost enough time already. <laughs> Your father, he is not going to be happy about uh, this. You know what? He's going to have to adjust. I mean, I'm the one making the decisions for my own life, not him. Not anymore. Okay. So what's next? What's next is uh, hoping I get married as soon as possible. Okay, then. Uh, okay, hey. yeah. Uh, <clears throat> okay. Mm -hmm. Hey, Justin, how long until the annulment is official? Oh, you know, what? Uh... You're serving Steffi with annulment papers? Today? Actually carried me over the threshold. Oh, Trey and Romantique. I know. God, Mom, I love him so much, and I never lost sight of that, or or how much I, I knew he loved me. It's just things got so off track, and I really thought that I had lost him. It was very concerning when you started to question everything that you believed in. Momentary setback, but. I know now that it was right to stay true to myself, to my morals, my principles. Because it really does pay off. I mean, look, I'm proof right here, right now. I have everything that I've ever wanted. <laughs> oh. 
What makes you think I'm keeping secrets? Oh, just something a little evasive in your eyes? Yeah, I just, I have a lot going on. Thoughts colliding in my head. I'm here to listen, if that's what you need. You are, aren't you? Better late than never. Hey, don't start talking smack about my dad, all right? Sweetheart, convince me that you're all right. Well, I'm not dancing on the ceiling. Things aren't great. There's a real possibility that I might end up losing Liam to hope for a while. But I guess I just have to learn the art of patience. I wouldn't want to see you put your life on hold for a man who may never come back. He will. I just have to wait hope out. You'll see, Dad. Liam and I, we will be together. Why the rush to dump Steffi? I'm not dumping her. What do you call it? I'm ending my marriage. So you can be with Hope? Yes. Do Steffi's feelings have any consideration at all in this? Taylor, the last thing I want to be doing right now is hurt Steffi. Then don't do this, because I guarantee you annulling this marriage will hurt. I'm sorry. I choose Hope. I don't deny that Steffi's made some mistakes. You both have, but that's, you know, that's part of marriage. That's part of learning how to make it work. You just don't invalidate a marriage because it's, it's getting a little bit rough. You need to try to work on it. Give it some time, Liam. Try some counseling. If you love Steffi the way you told me you do, then why would you want to break her heart? Has anybody talked to Steffi since she left Liam's? I haven't. You think she's coming in? I don't know. I, I feel like I should apologize to her Honey, or something. You didn't do anything wrong. It's it's just, I mean, Steffi and I are so estranged, and I, I don't think that that's going to be put behind us anytime soon. Especially because I asked Liam to get an annulment. We just, we want to get married as soon as possible. So what are you going to do? Are you going to have a real wedding? Or are you going to elope to Vegas and oh. have uh, Elvis or James Brown marry Oh, you? well, I hadn't thought of that, but now that you mention it. <laughs> so, what are you thinking? Oh, just something quiet and meaningful. Me in a white dress, Liam in a tux. Saying our vows before God and the people who matter to us in my mother's house, if that's okay with you. <laughs> yes! Yeah? Yes, of course, I would love that. You are going to be the most beautiful bride. Bride? I'm getting married! <laughs> <laughs> yes, you are! I can't believe it! It's oh. happening! Oh, yes, <laughs> you really are. Oh, my oh Mom. <laughs> No one wanted to see your marriage work out more than I did. I could see how happy Leah made you, how in love you were. I, I still love him, Dad. But you gotta look beyond. You got a lot more options out there open to you than Liam Spencer. Don't blame Liam for the mess that I made, okay? Look, you know when, when you're so afraid of something, it's like you do everything in your power to make sure it happens? It's called self-fulfilling prophecy. Yes. Yeah, it was like, I was so terrified of being abandoned. I just, I practically pushed Liam out the door. I mean, what is, what is with that? Yeah, well, that's me not being the perfect father. Oh, there you go. Dad, lighten up on yourself. These are my issues. And I let them drive Liam straight back to hope. At least I realize now it's just as well. How's that? They're unfinished business. Liam and Hope, they won't be able to move on unless they work through all their things. And once they do, Liam will come right back to me. In the meantime, there's always work. At my job. On myself. Steffi 2.0 coming up, new and improved. 
Just you wait. And I have so much work to do. Oi. Taylor, this doesn't mean that I don't love Steffi. Then why don't you act like it? Don't toss her aside. Okay, I don't expect you to understand this. But I need to be with Hope now. And Steffi is just part of the collateral damage. I don't know what else to say to you. Give these to Annie in the cutting room. Please. Thanks. Thanks. around. Wow. You look shot out of a cannon. Liam's about to hit Steffi with annulment papers. Oh. Well, you don't seem the least bit surprised. No, I knew it could possibly happen. Oh, of course you did. Yes. That's what the Logans are all about. Winning. No, Taylor. Liam loved Hope first, and then Steffi intervened for a while. Oh, and, and now he's just come back to his senses. I didn't say that, but okay. Oh, yeah, sort of like Ridge when he remarried me. That, or, well, he almost did. Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry, but you'll have to excuse me. I sound a little disconcerted because I see my daughter falling into the same vortex that I've been in. Oh, I know. I know. I knew what I thought. That our girls would grow up and fall in love with the same man. <laughs> It's like a big cosmic joke. Where nobody gets the last laugh. I've been expecting you. I'll bet. Taylor was just here. I'm starting to think it's becoming a trend. If you want to yell, you know, go ahead. Be justified. Yeah, something tells me it wouldn't do any good. No. You with hope now? Yes. That decision is final? It is. Then I have to respect that. Or take the prize for being the biggest hypocrite around. You're here. I work here. Unless you know something I don't. Usually it's the other way around. <sighs> all right, look, Steffi, all cards on the table right now. I'm not sorry that I am back with Liam. In fact, I'm over the moon about it. But I am sorry that it had to come at your expense. I appreciate that. I messed up. If I'd been honest in my marriage, he wouldn't be with you. But he would, Steffi. That's the point. Liam and I belong together, and I know that you've never respected that, but there it is. Right. And my marriage is but a speed bump on the road to true love. Don't kid yourself. What Liam and I have is real. I know that he still has feelings He for loves you. me. Granted. Even so, it's over between the two of you, so it's time for you to let go. That's just not gonna happen. Sorry to interrupt. Uh, you got a minute? Yes, sure, come on in. Liam wanted me to give this to you right away. Steffi. I mean, this, this 
decision was not easy for me, but Hope and I deserve our chance. And if it doesn't work? Then we'll deal. That's about all you can do. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Says the voice of experience. You'd be wise to heed it. I know. Rich, I can't give you what you want. I'm not asking, Liam. I might have intended when I walked through the door. But I see something in you that's all too familiar. A man very much in love with two very different women. And no one knows better. That is not an easy place to be. Is this Bill's doing? Bill, no. He doesn't know anything about it. Neither do I. Liam and I, we never discussed an annulment. Why would we? It basically wipes out our marriage. So you need to tell me what's really going on. Steffi, it is what it is. I'm sorry, but Liam wants an annulment. He wants to move on with his life. He, uh, take your time. Call me in my cell when you've signed it. That was never his intention. Wait a minute. You pushed him to do this. Look, Steffi. Liam and I have lost a lot of time. And we want to get married as soon as possible. No. You want to get married immediately. Only I'm in the way. My marriage isn't some kind of shameful thing. We're just going to pretend like it never happened. No, Steffi, no one is saying that. No, well, the papers do. That's what an annulment is. This is saying that my marriage is a mistake. Oh, my marriage never was, never will be a mistake. We, we were happy together. And now I'm supposed to sign something that says none of it was real? No. Steffi, I'm really sorry that you're hurting right now. But Liam has made his intentions very clear. We want to get married as soon as possible. Steffi, Liam has signed those papers. You should do the same. 